Dave and I work is just constant back and forth, and, and, and we don't f necessarily have things flow through a pipeline of step one, step two, step three. We're going back and forth, and you know, I might fiddle with a little music and then say, hey, you know what, now that I've played this music, turns out this instrument, you know, 12 notes isn't enough anymore. I need like 15. Can we put like another, another three over here? And he'll go, oh, okay, well, how about we, you know, and then now it has 15, and then next thing you know, I don't need all 15 af after all, just 14. And, you know, so it sort of continues and evolves like that. It's a very, very organic kind of process. Yeah, we tweak things right till the end. I mean, constantly trying different colors on different things and different lighting. And there's a lot of freedom there. It's it's really nice way to work. Dave and I both have a have a hard time sometimes letting go. So we just want to do one more tweak because we just want to get it really perfect. My favorite part of the process is building all these instruments, building these cool sets for them to live in, and you know, making them look really nice and look like they've been used. You know, we try to make things have wear marks on them a little bit, and like their drum heads and uh, that kind of thing. And so it's fun to just be able to build these worlds that then come to life with the music, and it's it's really interesting. Yeah, I like I like the part of when when we first prototype an individual instrument and we're just rendering uh, the initial tests of it. We have actually some of this stuff on the bonus material of the DVDs where you just see these individual instruments by themselves on a black black background with nothing else. That's actually my favorite part, just to watch one instrument playing by itself with no other distraction, no fancy camera moves and and lighting, and if that instrument by itself is interesting enough to sit there and watch in a loop playing over and over, then I know that we're onto something that's cool.